What's up guys and welcome to my first Minecraft tutorial and hopefully there will be more um so today I am going to be showing you how to make a very simple combination lock um so first I'm just going to show an example um my combination is this so now when I press this button the door will open and then I'm in my house and all it is is some very simple wiring um, actually I should show this, this is the very simple wiring this is underground which I will also be showing just to simplify things and cause this is how much room like you don't get like any room with this design but if you put it all underground you get all of this so I'm going to show you what happens when you get the combination wrong. Let's just say they're all up. And it won't work. You could do a trap probably if you were pretty good with redstone. Um, that would make you fall to your death. And it would be pretty cool. Um, and this pattern doesn't work. No patterns but the one work. So... Just gonna enter the right pattern and bam. It's a good way to keep your house um protective on servers. Um especially if they can't break blocks um in that area. Or if they can, you can build out of obsidian, um, which would be a hassle, but never mind that. Um so I'm going to be showing you how to build it. Okay, so I'm going to be showing you how to build the combination lock. So first, you're just going to want to build a wall. Um, they can be um, two or higher. Um, and, and as long as you want. So you're also going to need an iron door right here. Um, just gonna put the sandstone there just to look good. And then, you are going to, actually I'm just gonna count this out. Okay, I made it a bit too long, but whatever. You're gonna want to place a button, um, one block away from the door. Because if you had it right here and you press it, the door will open no matter what the combination is. So you're gonna want it one block away. So you're gonna skip this block, then put it there. Then you're gonna skip another block, and then you're gonna put your lever. And you can do however many levers you want in your combination. I'm gonna showcase four. Um, so for your levers, you're gonna do every other one, like that. And then you're going to put a piece of your building block behind all of the levers and your final button <clears throat> and you're gonna place redstone on all of them <clears throat> sorry about that just got a tiny cough um, and then you're gonna flip the levers that you you're gonna put in your combination that you want so I'm going to do every other like that so the the redstone that is activated you're gonna put a redstone torch under the redstone tor the redstone torch will be off um that's because this is activated so if I had it anywhere else it would be lit up but it is not so I'm just gonna get rid of this um you are going to run redstone out um three blocks from this piece of redstone but except for on the redstone torches you're just gonna have two um, just put it all even out to here, and then you are ready to start your wiring. You're going to connect them all, except for the button, and then you're going to need one block. You can put it anywhere. You can put it here, you can put it here, but anywhere. Um, well, sometimes depending on how long it is, you just want to put it more towards the middle. Um, so you're going to place your block, you're going to put redstone on top of it, and a redstone torch right here. 
And then, off of that redstone torch, you're going to take it out and go until one block before this wire. And then you're going to put um, three building blocks. Um, I actually put that redstone one too far. And then you're going to put an AND gate right here. So, put a torch right there, torch right there, torch right here, and um, it's snowing. That's not good. Um, I'll be right back when the snow is Okay, gone. so I have um, stopped the snow. So, this is where we were. Um, place a redstone, a piece of redstone right there. Um, sorry if you can hear my dogs, they're barking right now. Um, but from that piece of redstone, you're just going to run it to your door. And it should be in working order. And then you're just going to place a button right here on your door, um, so you can open it from the inside. This is going to look really ugly in your house, because this redstone's going to be right here. But I will show you how to fix that in a minute. So, it should work. And if the combination is wrong, it should not work. So, voila, you have made a very simple combination lock. But now, I'm going to show you how to put it all underground. Okay guys, so I'm going to be showing you how to build the much more compact version, well it's not more compact, but the more hidden version of this. <clears throat> Sorry. So, see how much more room there is in here than there is in here. This is the design I just showed you how to make right here. So this is all the room you're going to get out of that. And it's going to look horrible because there's going to be redstone going up to your door and stuff, which I mentioned before. But like this, you can cover this all up and act like it's not there. So I'm going to be showing you how to do that. So all I have done is I have placed the, uh, the, actually, I'll be right back. Sorry about that, guys. My dogs were going crazy and stuff. So, I had to go down and shut them up. So, all I did was build this wall, put the door, the button, and the levers. So, there's nothing behind it or anything. So, let's put stuff behind it. So, you're going to put blocks behind all of the levers and the button and then behind all those levers you're going to put the redstone just like before oh whoops there oh whoops again double fail so you're just going to put redstone all over all of them then you're going to run down the line a tiny bit here and then you're going to mine down put one there mine down put one there mine down put one there mine down, put one there. So then, you're just gonna, um, dig down your line until you're completely underground. Um, so this is too below, that is enough room. So, just gonna go down to there. Um, oh, go down here. And I think that's enough. I think that's as much as I went before. No, I went to there before. Um, so I'll just be filling this all in here. Okay. Um, so going to go what down, down here. Go two more down here. Um, go two more down here. And there. So, at this point, all you really want to do is, um, clear out, um, an area. Just, I don't know about the size, but I didn't go that far into it. Just mine back like four and um you can always expand it later remember that um oh there's a fail on fail here gotta go a bit farther okay 
I'm gonna go in there. I'm going to be speeding this up, um, emptying the room, so see you when that's done. Okay, so once you're in here, you're just gonna do the exact same thing. Um, so, oh, darn it. <laughs> Sorry. I meant to destroy this. And, oh, I don't even know what I'm doing here. So, this is a fail and fail thing here. So, you're going to put your combination that you want in here. I'm going to do the same thing as before. I'm going to do every other. So, on the ones that are toggled on, you're going to do the same thing and put a torch right there. And... From here, we're just doing the exact same thing as we were doing before, um, just underground. So, actually, I don't think I need that one. Um, just connect them all, um, put your black, put that redstone, torch. Um, speaking of torch, you might want to torch up this room a bit so mobs don't spawn. Um... Just gonna put down the AND gate then. And the redstone torches. Redstone in the middle. Um, gonna mine a bit off this way. And then gonna put the torch right there. So at this point, I think we are done. Um, but I do not know where the door is. Let's see. I gotta go one more this way. Ah, this is really bad. Um. So you're just gonna go this way until you are under the door, which is just gonna take some trial and error of going up and down. So I gotta go a few more. So I think I'm under the door. Actually, no. There's sandstone under the door, isn't there? No, there's not. Um, now I'm behind the door. This is really failing. Okay. So, when this block is the door. So. Actually, I'm just going to make sure it's the door. Yeah, it blocks the door. So, you're going to put this on. Um, but, since the door is gonna, always going to be open then, you're going to need to put another inverter. Um like so um actually just gonna move it down this is gonna be your inverter um you're gonna have two inverters actually because if you run redstone right under the door it won't work so like this and you are done um i gotta find out where i went wrong on this oh that's where i went wrong i'm i'm really sorry about that um, what we're actually going to need to do is build one up here, um, and then you're going to put your torch right here, and redstone there. So now your door is closed, and if you have the right combination in, and you press this button, it'll open. If you have the wrong combination in, and you press the button, it won't open. So that is the more compact version, um, or more hidden version. So after you have that, you can just block off. Oh, actually, you can go one more like this. Oh, God, I suck. Wait, that's not cutting off the line. Yeah, it is. Um, so you're just going to put one more block like that. Then you can build your wall right here, going behind this then you can just build the thing that will hide this and you're pretty much done so well you are done you just need to like build the house around it um actually you need to put a button here so you can get out you don't want to be locked in your house so it'll still work and that is really What redstone did I cut off here? Um, 
doesn't look like I cut off any. Oh, sorry. Um. Okay, you know what? I'm just re-recording this. Um, I don't know why it's not working. It just isn't. Um. But that would be because I have the wrong combination. In. What a dirt. What a dirt. You suck. Not you suck. I suck. I suck with. Mmm. Oh my god. Um. I think this tutorial was more entertainment of you watching me fail, but I you still got the idea. It's quite simple. If you don't get it, um, leave a comment saying what's wrong. Maybe um, send me a picture of it. Um, um, maybe a video response or something like that. But, yeah, so that is how you do it. Um, I'm sorry I derped so bad on this one, but it works, <laughs> surprisingly, and I actually got through that door, surprisingly. So, yeah, thanks for watching my first tutorial, and hopefully there's many to come.